In this video, I'm going to show you how to take role using the usage reports in Zoom. On the left hand side of the screen, in the nav bar, click on the Reports tab. Then you'll click on Usage. I'm going to set it to the entire month of August. Now let's say that I wanted to see who attended my August 4th Zoom 101 class. I actually have to scroll down to the very bottom of the screen, past the class that I want to look at actually. I have to keep scrolling down to the bottom until I get to the slider bar. Now, depending on the size of your screen that you're working with, you may not have to do this step. So I'm going to slide it all the way to the right, and this is going to give me the participants column. So for example, here I can see that on PD day, we had 614 attendees in the Zoom session. So now I'm going to scroll back up until I get to that August 4th class. So this is when a wider computer screen would come in very handy. I actually had to reshoot this video because the first time I did it, I thought this was the August 4th class. So you're going to want to double check that you're looking at the correct class. So here I can see that there were 16 attendees in this session. And then the number 16 is actually a hyperlink. So when I click on it, I'm going to get a pop-up box that tells me who these folks were. And then I can take role accordingly. You'll also notice that there is a column for duration. So it shows you how long each person was in the class. So sometimes their Wi-Fi just conks out and then they miss the entire class so they cannot be awarded flex credit or maybe they had to leave early because they're teaching a class. In those cases, you would email our office at prodev at elcamino.edu, and then that way we can award the partial flex credit accordingly. At the top of the screen, you'll see an export button where you can export this list as a CSV file. If you had a really big number of attendees, that can come in very handy.